Hi guys, third video for the day. Man, my words are coming out. And it, you know, shows you my age, dead. <laughs> my hair means, you know, wisdom. Which is good. Because, you know, we need all the wisdom we can get. Well, right now, uh, I've been watching the news. The thing I don't understand is in the news, right? Especially in New York and Illinois. And all the cities in New Jersey. They're supposed to have forecasting more deaths. For the, uh, the the strain that was going on, that's happening right now, you know the strain I mean, right? The you know what? But the thing is, is this: I'm a skeptic, okay? It's maybe my age. Are all those uh, you know, things that are happening, especially in New York and in in Los Angeles, are those either flu or pneumonia? That's the question because you know the strain masks. As also as a pneumonia thing, you know, it affects the same thing as pneumonia, but faster. But the deaths, you know, there's a lot of people die of flu each year, and that's the thing I'm I'm wondering, because the government did that, you know, especially Democratic governments like in Los Angeles, and uh, we call this uh, Illinois, New Jersey, New York, we still most of their people are corrupt, okay, and then you know, uh and when, when it comes to shove the debt, they rather collect more tax than that and spend it on quality things like emergency things. Now, we call this guy in the government Cuomo that says, well, now he admits that some people might be stealing stuff from from, uh, from the hospitals. No shit, Sherlock. Like, you know, you know, like, you know they take the example, they take the example of that from their politicians. And that, politicians. See what I mean? And they're blaming Trump. And most of those deaths that I don't see, and they have this, all of these tents. Okay? They say there must be people quarantined. Have you noticed most of the camera people from New York or ABC, they never enter, what we call this, uh, they never enter the, the, the emergency room itself? Because you know, if you want to create a scare, you gotta show people are really sick. I don't see people lined up. That's about it. But not, you know, if you go into you know, most uh, most emergency rooms that are around the country like that, they're, they're not showing them. They're not showing them like in Texas or in New, New Mexico. Only New York and in Chicago. Why is that? Because that's the most people are mostly getting sick because everybody is on top of each other. Especially when you live in the city. Now, what happens? Okay, all these things that are grappling for funds, they don't have any funds anymore because they stopped the damn economy. Okay, you stop the damn economy, what happens? You gotta tax everybody, okay? And if they're not working, now we can get the funds. Okay, you spend your pet projects, you, you know, you read the pension funds of some, of some workers. You know, you know, we call this, you know, and most construction work that's not done yet. And guess what? Oh, I'm crying. Trump's not doing anything. Well, Sherlock should did something that when you know, Obama's in. She should, should have padded up your uh, your budget to that for the emergency. You did not. You know why? Because you rather keep the money to yourself. And guess what? All these Democratic cities that like Newsom, Bretzker, Como, and I gave New Jersey. Okay? You know, we call we call this you know they they cost too much drama for themselves and then they're making them look like fools. Shows you the death, you know, and also the guy, the guy Mayor de, de Blasio. How about this? The, you know, no, um, uh, the, the, the new mayor of Chicago. Lightfoot or something, okay? Another person that, that needs to be examined a little bit. Okay, she's stopping people from going to parks. Okay. What's supposed to be going to do? Stay inside? They might get in second size, you know, most of them to get depressed. They'll find ways to break those rules, you know, that they, you know, and then they have the cops enforcing it. Instead of chasing crime and looters of that or just or protect the properties, you send them an errand mission to that of you of controlling people. Now, you want to, you know, you like Democratic mayors now? You see how bad they are? Okay. Look at what's happening in Las Vegas right now. No, the casino shut down. Okay, the minute they close up, the, they gonna close up the liquor stores. They, they, no, the governor, the governor sister looks like, uh, uh, you know, he doesn't have any answers to that. You know, he wants to close more stuff. In Texas, they clo you know, okay, the Rep Republican governor, smart guy, all right, wrong. You know, you know, he, you know, he's shutting down people coming in. You know, uh, 
people are coming in that state of that. They say, is it only people who are business can come in a state across your state? You know, that's a violation of common law and travel. You can't hinder people's travel. The interstate is not yours. It's the federal government's. And you're trying to block the borders, where the borders are. Mostly interstate. You know, what do you call it? That? You, know, uh, you can't stop people from moving around. It's it's a given. You cannot stop people from doing what they want. They want vice, they want vice. And that's why this this lockdown has to end. After one month, I've been a uh, follower of President Trump. Okay, end it. Because you know why? He's going to drive more people, more divorces than that, more babies might be coming. Because you know, you're staying inside. But most of all, it's tanking your economy. Hell, you know, my neighbors, they got laid off already, you know, because they had no jobs. What could you do? You got to pay bills. It's rent season right now. I, you know, I paid my rent already. But imagine that the ne- next month. This is getting crazy, folks. You know, we call this that, you know, uh, if the, the Democrats happen is up to that, they should be tossed in jail. That's a sin. You know you know why we call this? Because you don't like the president because you guys lost. You know why you guys lost? Because you guys are suck. You know, if the Democrats want something like that, they get to that and they abuse it. Okay? They're like those people that who are that you know, those people in class that they're gonna bully to that. They're always thinking they're right. Uh, and then when they get to power that they don't listen to anyone. Because you know why they have the power to make everyone miserable. That's why in my opinion is that if you're gonna run for office of that, you know, I don't care Republican, Democrat. I mean, like, you can only you know only serve one in you know, a one term and that's it. And next week, politicians part time, okay? Maybe three months, that's it. Go home, do your own job, get a job. Don't make it a full time thing. You know, if you make it a full time thing, well, guess what happens? That's when corruption happens, okay? No more offices inside the in, in the capital, okay? If you're in an office, stay at home, go home, okay? That those offices there should be used for storage. This is what happens to that when we, you know when the people give you too much leeway. Power corrupts people. See what I mean? Bye bye.